What's up students, it's your boy PGT, we're back with another video. Today I'll be reviewing the Boomer Schwimmer Inflatable Tub. I'm going to send a big thank you out to Ashley for sending me one of these. If you don't know about Ashley, she runs a YouTube channel called Boomer Schwimmer. Go check her out because she's got some great videos on mycology. Alright, so today I'll be doing an unboxing and going over my thoughts on the tub. Alright, so first thing off, I am really impressed with the packaging. She's able to kind of fit everything here in a very small form factor and doesn't waste any time with space. Alright, so it looks like I get some stickers here. I'm going to be adding these stickers into my wall plate collection. So, got a receipt here and we got a card from Ashley. Alright, you can pause this video here if you want to read the card. I'm, I'm going to skip through it. Alright, so here we have the actual inflatable tub very nicely sealed. Let's open this up. And looks like it's folded here. And if you're wondering about the gloves thing here, I was kind of in the middle of pouring some agar. So that's kind of why I had it on. Um, but anyways, uh, back to the tub here. Uh, seems like a very standard inflatable plastic. So it's very lightweight. And I think these inflatable tubs are great for beginners that are getting into the hobby. It's already come prepared with everything you need to fruit mushrooms in a pretty optimal level. Alright, so here's the bottom of the tub. So you get a little drain port it seems here. Now, I really like the design of this because it just makes rehydrating and getting your next flush going a lot easier. You don't have to mess with the tubs tipping over or anything, you just pull the plug and drain it out and you're done. So up here is the valve to inflate the tub. Alright, so here I have the tub fully inflated. It didn't take too long for me to kind of just inflate by, uh, you know, blowing into it. So here's what you get with the tub. You get a little flap on the top here with some Velcro on it. Got some holes in the side here for fresh air exchange. And you got the little drain port at the bottom of the tub here. Alright, so what else comes in the package? You get the foam filters and little plastic plugs here for the holes all right so what these are for is uh, you want to put the plastic plugs in the holes to kind of seal them up when you're spawning and colonizing your tubs once your stuff gets fully colonized it's going to be more resistant to contamination and at that point you can switch over to the foam filters to increase fresh air exchange to initiate fruiting conditions Right here I have a tub spawned out. I just mixed in some grain spawn and some substrates together. Now if you want to see a video on the process, there's one that's made by Fungi Mycology that goes into detail with this. I have a link to the video in the description if you guys really want to check it out. With everything fully colonized, I'm going to go ahead and switch over to the foam filters in order to initiate fruiting conditions for them. Mushrooms love humidity and they love fresh air, so I'm going to switch into these foam filters and it's going to provide uh, increased fresh air exchange for them. All right, so one of the nice things you can do about the flap lids is you can use this to fan your tub if you need more fresh air exchange. Uh, I've noticed the foam filters and the plugs here. They're also purchasable on our website if you ever need more of them. And I just found out she just included uh, liners in the tubs now. So if you were to get one, you, you get the whole package now. So Alright, and last thing I want to touch on is just cleaning this thing when you're done. Since I spawned it here without a liner, uh, cleaning is going to be a little bit tough. You kind of have to get into the little cracks and creases of the tub. So, if you have a liner, however, um, it's going to make cleaning a lot easier. Alright, so the flushes were great, and the results here I'm going to have on my Patreon, where you can see the full version of this video. But overall, I would say it's a great design on this. Uh, you got a great thing here going, actually. Uh, so here's a demonstration of how you can rehydrate for the next flush. You just fill it up with some water, let it soak, and then we're going to pull the drain plug over a sink and you'll get rid of the water very easily. Alright, so here's me pulling the plug and letting it drain out. So, I really like this design here. So, what do I think about it? I think it's fantastic. Everything is so thawed out and the tub makes growing more convenient and easy. 
I would easily recommend this if you're on the fence about getting one. That's it for this review. I'll have a link in the description below where you can get one of these inflatable tubs. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next one.